YouTube, what's up? Hellspawn here. Found a cool, couple cool things. Picked up some cool things and received something cool. Um, all sorts of neat stuff going on, y'all, uh, today. And it was almost a little unexpected um, because today was kind of like a day for me to get a few errands done. And, you know, I had something that I had to pick up from uh, Walfart, the land of evil. And, um, you know, I just didn't expect uh, to get, uh, I didn't expect to run into so many cool things today. But I ended up doing so. Uh, first and foremost, I picked a few things up from work the other night. Um, new Boulevard cars. I, uh, I found another fresh case. And I didn't have the money. Well, I did. But I just, I'm trying to reduce how much I spend. So the only day, I only pick up things that I really, really want. But I got the old 442 from the new uh, Boulevard series. And uh, I actually got two of those because... Anybody who collects Hot Wheels or watches Hot Wheels videos on uh, on YouTube knows that uh, knows of Dreadnought 320, and uh, he's trying to finish up his Boulevard set. So I went ahead and picked one up for him. We'll find the nicest card out of the two, which is this one, and then that one's going to go to Mr. Dreadnought. And this one, this son bitch, this beautiful teal and white hunk of chrome wheeled glory. Oops. Uh, guess we're going to open it. All part of the plan, folks. All part of the plan. There you go. Olds 442. Drips of awesomeness. Metal base. Metal body. Nice wheels. Rubber tires. Awesome. Still not as good as the garage cars, but that will do. Uh, at the same trip, I actually found my very first Hot Ones chase piece. And if you look at them tires, look at them chunky donuts of rubber. The hot one. So I actually, and this was actually the first one on the peg, the Sting Rod. Never was my favorite hot ones. I probably would never pick this car up by itself. But the fact that it's a chase piece, and it's the very first chase piece I've ever found in the store, uh, I could not pass that one up. So, got that. And I, uh, I was looking through the fresh cases on the pallets. The guy that was in the toy aisle, he was like, hey man, anything you want to open, open. And I didn't really think much of it. But I saw a Hot Wheels nostalgia box, and I was like, meh, it's probably just, you know, the same, you know, Masters of the Universe, Peg Warmer stuff that we've seen uh, for a long time. And I went, paid for my two Boulevard cars and my, my Sting Rod, and then I said, you know what, I'm going to go back and check it out. Lo and behold, it's not the Nose Art cars, which I'm going to go ahead and just say that now. I want that entire freaking set of cars, the, the new Nostalgia, the Hot Ones, the, not the Hot Ones, but the, uh, the Nose Art cars. I want that whole set. Every single car I want. Um, but I found another new series, and it's the new Hershey series. And as you can see, there is a uh, Volkswagen, Volkswagen custom whatever, uh, what is it, the square back. Sorry, this thing is not focusing too well on me right now. Okay, man. And then there's the uh, Studebaker Champ, the, uh, the whatchamacallit, 63 Studebaker Champ, the Jolly Rancher, Custom 69 Volkswagen Squareback, then you got the 70 Chevelle Delivery, the 71 El Camino from, what candy is that, Payday, the 5th Avenue is the uh, Delivery, and then you've got the, uh, the Supervan, the Hershey's Supervan, and the Reese's Pieces Volkswagen uh, uh, bus, van, whatever. Um, so which one do you think I picked up? course I picked up the Reese's Pieces van Volkswagen man gotta love these V dubs so I went ahead and picked up that I love the top of that van I almost want to like take some alcohol and get rid of the tampos the Reese's tampos and just leave behind that sweet paint job so I picked up that not only did I pick up one of those I actually picked up uh, two of those so two of the new Reese's nostalgia Volkswagen vans so there you go that's what I picked up the other day. Now, I went to Walmart to get my site to store order, which is actually, check it out, Jammers. Um, these are by a company called Creative Options, and it's a double-sided thread organizer, AKA an exact replica of a Hot Wheels jammer case. Ugh. 
open that up like that and shabang look at that absolutely freaking perfect and you can uh, find these on the Walmart online uh, they do not sell them in stores but for the price of nine dollars a piece you really can't beat that they are double-sided does have both sides of a jammer case uh, but yeah double-sided the Hot Wheels it works perfect they're just they almost exactly the same as jammer cases um, go on uh, walmart.com now don't get me wrong I freaking hate Walmart but there's just some things you can't ignore and uh, search for creative options it should be the first thing that comes up on the page nine bucks if you use the site and store option shipping's free and I ended up getting uh, two of those so eighteen dollars free shipping two jammers cases which would normally cost you like 20 bucks online a piece um, so yeah like I said not endorsing Walmart at all but there's some things that you just can't can't pass up um, I decided to look in the Hot Wheels aisle while I was there found just a few things Hot Wheels are still on sale for less than a dollar so they're only like 80 cents a piece or something I found the uh, funny side up funny side up right there I found the hot pink 70 Plymouth A Arcuda and I collect pink cars from my wife so this will go in her collection of pink cars and then I found the uh, Volcano Series Blast Lane motorcycle uh, which I thought that was pretty cool I also ran across a couple doubles uh, the, uh, the 81 Camaro the 70 Road Race Camaro and the Mercury uh, drag Merc, whatever, 49 drag Merc, and I picked those up for a friend of mine. Uh, so those are his. And then, the great part is I had to mail off a couple packages for eBay, and uh, when I dropped the packages off with the mailman, lo and behold, I have a package waiting for me. And it's from the uh, always awesome Mextalicat down in Texas, Aaron. Thank you, brother. Um, and I knew this was coming, but again, Aaron always goes over the top, and uh, so I know the very first thing that's in this package and that's it but he did send me a little note which I just threw on accident and uh, it says uh, what's up Nick here it is dude you're really gonna like this one I hope you enjoy your first mail-in car I remember how excited I was when I got my first I also added some really nice extras for you Aaron told me he was gonna send this to me and that's because Aaron's a badass that's because Aaron is uh, probably one of the coolest dudes on YouTube that I've ever met uh, him, Chap, uh, uh, Mario, TF Collector, Mr. Sensitivity, all you guys have been freaking awesome. And uh, I'm definitely glad to uh, call you my friends. Um, I got some awesome stuff on the way for you, Aaron. Aaron bought a couple Marvel Legends things from me, older Marvel Legends stuff, and an Apocalypse Build-A-Figure. But I, that's one box, and I've got an entirely second box with uh, some cool stuff in there for Aaron, too. Not to mention I've got a third box, which is in progress of being built for him right now. Uh, but isn't going to be ready to ship until I throw a few more little goodies in there for him. So, uh, but you got two boxes headed your way as of this weekend, bro. Um, work's been crazy, money's been a little tight, and I've just uh, got everything good to go, and they'll be going out to you on Saturday. But there it is. There's your uh, K-Day exclusive mail-in. The 55 Chevy panel. And I will be getting the rest of the mail-ins, too. I'll be making sure of that. Uh, a couple other things that he sent me. Got a couple extras in here. Oh, sweet, dude. Uh, Volkswagen Beetle with a pimped out engine sticking out the back there. Uh, here's another sweet ass Volkswagen Beetle. Same casting, different color. Cool as shit, man. Thank you, sir. And then, uh, oh, 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 I just dropped you. I just dropped you. I'm sorry. Hope you're okay. Let's see what else he sent me. Oh, dear God. Look at that, man. Freaking awesome drag truck thank you dude I watched that video and when I was looking at those things I was like those things are so cool those things are so cool I need to get a few of those and uh, that's super awesome that you thought of me and uh, and saved one for me sorry about the cam camera glare there guys I'm trying to do this on the fly uh, oh, dude no you did not alright it looks like he did he sent me one of the dub cities that he picked up 32 Ford badass truck car classic thing you do thank you sir and he hooked me up with a whole ball sack load of Marvel mini mates which I'll be doing a video on uh, soon so anyways that's everything thanks for tuning in we'll see you guys later peace